Gun fam, what's up? Thanks for tuning in. It's the Gun Brother. Uh, today, let's talk about this emergency proposed rulemaking for 2343.1, ammo carried by licensee in D.C. Let's get into it. All right, so not too long ago, uh, September 14th, an emo emergency proposed rulemaking was filed to amend section uh, 2343.1, which regulates the amount of ammo a licensee, concealed carry licensee can carry in DC. And the, rate that, the way that reads is this, let's check it out. 2343.1, a person issued a concealed carry license by the chief while carrying the pistol shall not carry more ammunition than is required to fully load the pistol twice. And in no event shall that amount be greater than 20 rounds of ammunition. That's the ruling that was challenged by Dick Heller. Um, and it was filed September 14th that that is going to be repealed. Okay. So here is a picture of the filing. All right. So as you can see, this is an official filing. Notice the notice of emergency proposed rulemaking. And just kind of going through the whole thing. Just getting to the bottom of it. Subsection 2343.1 is repealed and this is adopted immediately however this case is stayed until uh october 22nd so that says you can carry as much ammo as, on your person as you want or i guess that's what it's going to end up saying however that is not the same part of dc code that stipulates high capacity magazines being illegal okay that's a whole different part so let's take a look at that so this is in dc code 7-2506.1 Persons permitted to possess ammunition, and as we can see um, here, uh, subsection B, a large capacity ammunition feeding device means a magazine, belt, drum, feed strip, or similar device that has a capacity of or that can be readily restored or converted to accept more than 10 rounds of ammunition. So that's a whole nother part of DC code. So what Heller Challenge said is the amount of ammunition you can carry. That is not the same part that says a 10 round magazine is all that's allowed in DC. So those are two different things. Now, could MPD come back and just change it all? Of course, we'll see what happens. I don't, I, maybe, maybe not, <laughs> but that is not what is repealed. What was repealed is 2343.1 and all that, all that regulates is how much ammunition you can carry. So don't confuse the two unless they publish something saying, um, you can carry as much ammo as you want, and magazine capacity is also unrestricted. Those, again, two different things. Now, I am not a, a legal expert. With the case being stayed till the 22nd, I don't know when it comes into play or is, is, is going to be enforced. Um, I leave that legal stuff to uh, Coleon and Arm Scholar. Those guys are lawyers. They understand that. But I'm just telling, I'm just showing you what was filed, what was challenged, what the result was, and that magazine capacity is another thing so we'll see if they change it all or if they just change the one thing all right and so with that being said stay armed keep practicing keep shooting and the gun brother is out